Hello, Hello everyone. So in today's video, we are moving from the Lowlands over to Campbelltown to see. We look at some whiskies over there, and today we have the Glen Scotia 15-year-old single malt whiskey. Um, this 15-year-old uh, is 46 percent alcohol, and it costs around 550. Danish crowns for 70 centiliters, which is around 55 English pounds and um, maybe 70 American dollars, something like that. Um, the Glen Scotia was recently bought by the distillery uh, Loch Lomond, if that's how you say it. And um, Loch Lomond is also a big uh, lake in Scotland, but there's a distillery right beside it, and that's called the Loch Lomond. And they bought the Glen Scotia. And um, Glen Scotia, I don't know the distillery, but they're supposedly uh, known for doing the packaging and the bottle and the label really, really nice. But then the whiskey lacks quality. Uh, Lac Lomond supposedly uh, changed this. And um, this 15-year-old is the first bottling after, um, after they took over. So... As I don't know Glen Scotia, I'm not really going to be able to compare it, but I am going to be able to tell if this is quality to me anyway. Uh, this whiskey is uh, not artificially colored and it is not chill filtered, um, so that's amazing. It has been in American oak for all 15 years, so that should be interesting. That's, that will definitely do something for uh taste uh yeah when you compare it to uh european oak and or a mixture of the two so yeah this is uh really looking forward to it um it looks like this and as you can see for an artificial for a natural colored whiskey it's quite dark you can't see that on the tapes there or on the video i can see it's a lot darker in real life than it looks like on the uh, on the monitor right now so yeah let's crack this open and uh, look into it and see what happens so when my daughter was home one of my daughters is home she's sick so she couldn't make it to school um, and she's really looking at me uh, she's around 12 and she thinks this whole YouTube thing is uh, pretty cool so yeah she doesn't know whiskey though so but back to the thing that this is all about really smooth nose with vanilla a little bit of sherry actually sherry notes an oak. Really nice, actually. Um, and a beautiful, beautiful little dram. Look at the way it clings to the glass. So it's kind of oily. I don't know if you can see it. Yes, I think you can see that. Uh, it's got a honey-like texture and, um, and a lot of oils in it. So that must be from the American oak. So cheers guys, let's go. Wow, it's so powerful. And sharpness, but not too much because the flavors and the um, oh, mouth-watering. Wow, it's really powerful. I can feel it in my ears and I can feel it in my nose and just all the way down. This is lovely to me. Really amazing. Because it's, it's sharp and there's kick and there's warmth, but not too much so that you can or that i can't um distinguish the flavors i can still 
easily distinguished vanilla, uh, oak, a honey feel to it. Oh yeah, and spices. And still there, the, the finish, all through the, the nose and the palate and the finish, there's vanilla, oak, sherry, and um, in the palate, there's also um, spices, and also in the finish, there's spices. I didn't really get that in the on the nose. Wow, this is a really nice one. Mm. Just <clears throat> powerful, uh, complex, and it has depth. Different nuances of flavors and um, aromas just, just complement each other. Really, really good and powerful. I really like that. Wow. I was thinking... 8 or 8.5, but I might have to bump this up to a 9. Uh, wow, this is really good. If you never tried this, if you can find it, give it a try. It's really good. I will be putting the Glen Scotia 15-year-old uh, single malt whiskey from Campbelltown at an 8.5. So, quite high. That's the verdict for me. Try it out if you uh, if you feel like it. Really beautiful. Um, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't like the video, give it a thumbs down. Uh, please comment, ask questions, uh, give me ideas to new videos, new whiskeys, new drinks that I should try out, and just any comment, I will respond to all comments. And uh, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. That would really mean a lot to me. Oh, yeah. And as always, please go check out my uh, Instagram account. It's Dungan underscore. And just look at the pictures and small video clips. And um, if you like what you see, please give me a follow there as well. Oh, yeah. And I forgot there's no sponsored content in this video. And as always, everything on this video or in this channel is just my opinion. So just to say that here at the end. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.